Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys my 5 a.m. morning routine. So the first thing I do is all of my hygiene things. So brushing my teeth, washing my face, doing my hair, drinking my water. And then I go into the things that um, is the real reason of why I'm getting up at 5 a.m. So I'm doing my devotional. And then um, I've been studying every morning now. At first, I was studying when I get off work. But now I have been um, waking up at 5 instead of 6 and using the extra time in the mornings to study. I also stay off social media and I'm really loving this time in the mornings to be by myself. Check in on the beach reading the word of God. That's all. <laughs> you can hate this list. So in today's workout, I am doing back and biceps, aka pull day, and I'll have the details of this workout in the description box. So my routine starts with a warm-up, then I go into stretching, I do my strength training, my core, and then I do cardio at the end. For this workout, I'm doing two supersets, and then I have one exercise that's on its own. So in total, I have five exercises that I'll be doing. On the floor. I keep it juicy, dude. I eat that lunch. She keep that booty, booty. She keep that pump. That nice and beauty, beauty. Yeah, yeah. If you can see it from the front, it's how you see it from the back.
For this workout, I wanted you guys to notice how when I did the first sit, um, I was a little more, um, my feet was more forward, so it was harder for me to pull myself up. And then in the next set, I pulled my feet in a little bit so I wouldn't be as low to help pull myself up. And I just wanted to point that out because there's nothing wrong with having to adjust your workout if you realize that, you know, maybe you're not strong enough or something is a little bit too difficult for you. There's usually always a way to modify an exercise. So for cardio, I'm doing 20 minutes on the elliptical. I usually don't use the elliptical machine, but I didn't feel like really jogging on a treadmill. So I decided to use this machine for my cardio. And today was a low to moderate intensity cardio session. So I just did 20 minutes on here and it was pretty intense, but it's not something that would have wore me out. So I do want to show you guys my breakfast before I end this video. So I boiled me some eggs um, yesterday morning. I boiled four at a time. So I had two yesterday and two. I'm going to have two this morning. And then I have overnight oats. And in my oats I have oats, almond milk, cinnamon, Greek yogurt. And then on the top I have blueberries and banana. And for my eggs, I'm not going to eat the yolk. I'm just going to eat the egg whites. That is my breakfast for today. And then for lunch, I'm going to eat half of this sandwich that I got from Publix. It's a turkey wedge sandwich. Um, and I'm only going to eat half of it for lunch with some fruit. Um, I'm cooking today. And um, so that's why I had to go pick me up something. For dinner tonight, I'm making a baked ziti pasta. I think that's how you pronounce it. Ziti, Z-I-T-I. -I. I think, and I'm using these protein penne noodles with ground turkey, tomato sauce, mozzarella cheese, and Parmesan cheese. And then I'm also gonna bake some chicken thighs with um, broccoli. And I'm gonna eat that with some little broth, little, golden potatoes so my dinner well probably i'll probably eat that for lunch so for lunch i'm gonna have the pasta with green beans and then for dinner i'm gonna have the chicken with broccoli and potatoes you know i gotta always have my chicken with my vegetables as one of my meals and then my other meal is always the more creative meal that i want to try or like I usually let my other meal be something new like a new recipe or something that I just love to eat so like tacos or um, the pasta or whatever it is but I hope you guys enjoyed this morning vlog this is literally how my morning looks every single day um, the 5 a.m. thing I just started that back up this week because um I just realized that I could get a little bit more done if I woke up a tad bit earlier. So from now on, I'm going to be getting up at 5 a.m. And more than likely when I start training, I'm probably going to be waking up earlier. Um, like if I have 5 a.m. clients, which I do hope to have. Um, um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment what type of vlogs you want to see moving forward, health related. So if you want to see more of my workouts, if you want to see more of what I eat in a day, I'm going to be doing both regardless. But just want to see what you all would prefer.